Hi, this is Steve from RoofTwins.com. We specialize in roof repair in Round Hill, Virginia. In fact, 95% of all repairs that we perform is mainly because of faulty workmanship done by inexperienced roofers. Now, when I was inside this home, I noticed the ceiling on the top level of the home was very badly water damaged. Also, the inside the exterior wall was water damaged as well, and it was settling all the way down into the basement. This homeowner has paid another Round Hill roof repair company money before in the past to try to resolve the problem, but the leak keeps coming back every time there's a heavy downpour. So I asked her, what type of work did he do? And she told me that, well, he replaced some of the damaged flashing around the chimney and installed new shingles on the back side of the chimney. And I told her, I said, well, it's possible there may be another source to this leak. So when I went up on the roof, the first thing I wanted to see was the overall installation of the flashing, and everything was fine. The chimney most definitely was not a source of the leak, even though the water stains were directly below. Now, when I looked at everything even more closely, I noticed that there were nails exposed in the flashing underneath the roof shingles completely around the attic fan, and that will most definitely cause the chimney to leak. Um, so what we'll do here, we'll remove all the roofing material completely around the fan, seal the flashing under and above, then re-shingle that area. Now the problem is, this guy who originally did the repairs, he did such a wonderful job, but he just didn't understand how water can travel from further up a roof and show no signs of damage anywhere inside the attic space or inside the home but the water will settle at the chimney and can go all the way down into the basement. So the attic fan most definitely is a source of the problem. But when I looked even more, I noticed that there were two holes in the roof. And even though the holes weren't that big, they can cause a tremendous amount of damage directly below and then also travel underneath the shingles and wherever it finds an opening like a chimney, that's where the water will settle. And these holes were caused be, because of two by fours being nailed right through the face of the shingle. So what happened was when this roof was first being installed, they used the two by fours so they can walk around on the roof because the roof has a fairly steep slope and it makes it easy for them to load the materials up on the roof as well. Now the problem is when they're done with the roof, now they take the two by fours off along with the long nails that were holding the two by fours into place and they leave the holes in the roof. Now many contractors will put silicone or cement over the holes, but that will just crack or peel off in time and then the leak will just, you know, they'll develop a leak. So we're just going to replace those shingles, and once everything is repaired above the chimney area, this leak will not come back again. My name is Steve, and I'm from RoofTwins.com, and we specialize in roof repair in Round Hill, Virginia. And if you would like a free estimate, kindly give us a call at 703-997-9296. Have a great day.